what's going on guys this is the real two dog welcome back to my channel for another video it's actually been a while since I recorded I don't know if y'all have noticed but there has been a period in time where I haven't uploaded anything for several weeks I apologize for that uh, lately my life's been really busy uh, working full time plus some other stuff that I'm you know have obligations to this I just haven't had any time with for uh, for YouTube so it's been on the back burner for several weeks about a month now I think I don't know I remember but I do have content that I'm trying to like you know that I've been wanting to put together uh, in videos and stuff I just haven't gotten around to editing them because uh, I just don't have time oh shit oh shit oh shit Oh God, I felt that ABS kicking. This video is gonna be in response to me being nominated for the three x three challenge. I know it's a, for some reason, it's a pretty popular challenge right now for moto vloggers, or at least the, you know, the not so big ones, I guess you could say. I got uh, nominated by Irocracy. Everyone watching this, go follow him. He's another uh, local YouTuber, a uh, local moto vlogger here from Houston. And a 3x3 challenge. That is a challenge where the moto vlogger has to uh, say three things about himself that his subscribers and, and viewers might not know about him personally. And then nominate three other moto vloggers to uh, do the same. So here it goes. Number one. A lot of you know I live here in Houston, Texas. But a lot of you probably don't know that I was originally born in California. I was originally born in the San Francisco, specifically the Daly City area of California. So if any of my Cali folks who are following me, you know, hey, what up? <laughs> Number two. And now a lot of y'all know that I am Asian. Because, you know, you might have, because I show myself on video and y'all see my pictures on my Instagram follow me on Instagram by the way but the question is what kind of Asian am I I get mistaken for all kinds of Asians for the except for the right one I'm a Filipino actually what the hell is this oh a police escort <laughs> Ugh. but yeah Filipino born in San Francisco lived in Daly City So, number three, last but not least fact about me that you guys might not know. At one point in my life, I was almost a police officer. I was almost a cop at one point. I went through a police academy at, my, at a junior college near me. Graduated, passed, got T close certified, which is the Texas uh, law enforcement something or other it's what, it's what you need to be licensed to be a Texas police officer but anyways I got all that but I had such bad luck in getting hired by police departments that eventually I just gave up and uh, moved on <laughs> this was about probably a couple years after I got out of the Marine Corps but you know looking back on it now I'm fine with it I just, I don't know, I don't want to get into it really, but I'm pretty sure I'm okay with it, with me not being a, be a cop now. People change, I changed over time, you know, stuff like that, so I mean, without getting into too much detail, I'm fine with it, whatever. Who knows, my life would have been different, who knows. But yeah, so that's three things about myself and or past that uh, a lot of y'all might not know about me, and there you go. 3x3 three three challenge complete, well not really complete, I know, nominate three more people and I've got three people in mind. I'm gonna let y'all know on Instagram too that I nominated y'all. First up is Uncle Red Devil over there in the UK. He started motor vlogging before I did uh, and he's also a, a uh, fellow Vulcaness owner. I think I want to consider him one of the OG motor vloggers when it comes to Kawasaki Vulcaness. So yeah, y'all go give him a follow, and I nominate him as my first nomination. 
Nomination number two will be Moto Blade X. He is over in Tennessee, I believe. And uh, really good guy. He started moto vlogging around the same time I did with a Kawasaki Vulcan S at that. Really good production value on his videos. I'm, you know, I'll, I'll give him props. Like he does a lot of good work on his videos. And his channel is actually growing exponentially fast. Like he started, me and him started around the same time, and he's got like over 2K subscribers now. While I'm only like not even at 700. So yeah, so congratulations to him. Good job. He actually currently doesn't have the Vulcan S anymore. Uh, he's recently traded it in for a Indian Chieftain Dark Horse. Very very sexy bike. But yeah, anyways, go y'all go give him a follow and. That's my number two nomination. Number three nomination, Morphine City. Another Kawasaki Vulcan S moto vlogger who started uh, a couple, several months ago, I believe. But he too also has a good, pretty good production values in his videos. And uh, his channel, even though it just started, is uh, growing pretty quickly at a quick rate. I think he's like at 400, almost 500 subscribers now, and he only started several months ago, so he's, his channel's going faster than mine ever did so far at this point. Where he's over in New Zealand, and uh, a country that I love because I vacationed there not recently, and uh, man, I want to go back and I want to not come back here. <laughs> but yeah, so give him a follow, and uh, that will be my third nomination. Anyway, so that's it for the 3x3 challenge for me. Like this video, subscribe if you want to see more from me. I thank y'all for watching. And don't forget to share, comment if you want. It's all good. And, uh, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.